Sandy Skaggs says she's been storing this gun for a friend who owns it until Skaggs bought it today. I don't even like touching this thing. It's upsetting to me. She says the weekend shootings in Dayton and El Paso motivated this. I do not want the gun. I want to destroy this gun. So she's asking local police for the proper way to do it or give it to them to do it. She says she doesn't want it used for parts or anything else. She calls it a killing machine. I'm not opposed to hunting. I'm not opposed to hunters. I'm not opposed to people having guns in their possession for protection. But this is a killer. This is a killing machine and that's all it's for. But semi-automatic rifles are used by some hunters who like their accuracy or their versatility. And that is why they are popular with hunters. That's a legal weapon. People are entitled to, to own one. I that's mean, right. You know. Exactly. They are. I'm entitled to purchase it and destroy it. Even if she has to pour acid down the barrel to destroy the mechanism inside. A personal political statement against the gun and gun violence. As the issue of gun safety dominates not only Kansas City, but the nation once again. Michael Mahoney, KMBC 9 News. Now, late this afternoon, Skaggs found out that gun will be destroyed. Stephen, Kansas City police are going to be taking it to a facility in Kansas where the gun will be melted down.